At the start of the new millennium, the Ballard District of Seattle finalized plans for yet another outdoor shopping center with the customary retail tenants. There was nothing particularly novel about the development except one stubborn resident who refused to sell her house to the development company. Edith Mayfield's resolve tightened despite rising offers ultimately peaking at $1 million. In exasperation, the architect of the project simply designed the shopping center around her property, enabling her to continue living there. There were reports that she considered simply selling shortly before her death. She died on her couch in 2008 like her mother did 32 years before. She willed the house to the project building contractor who had befriended her. The diminutive house remains in limbo following further ownership changes. A defiant eyesore.